Moshi Moshi Mime Gamers and welcome back to Zealous Zone Zero. Today we are doing Wiener Story Quest. Before that we're gonna do this again, invitation. Let's invite Ellen again. <sighs> I'm so bored. So bored. Wanna do something? Got no plans today, enemies? We could go eat or just hang out. What do you pay? I'm good eating. Hang out at the video store maybe? Oh speaking of, I know you have some real fast internet. Uh some of the best. I'll come over and buy your net. When are you when are you free? I'll meet you at the store. Right now. I'm all inside. I'm mean, is ain't she right there already? Ooh, I think she is. <gasps> hey, hey Ellen, come to my bedroom. <laughs> my sister's not gonna know what we're doing there. Hey, you're here. Uh we do agree to me. What's your password? Uh exchange password to is too often. Awesome. It's just a necro password. No need to sound so serious. I thought you wanted my banking password. Ugh, what do you usually get yourself into? I just thought, considering your job, you have connection speed. I can't seem to navigate this slow at 404 Live. Maybe I have a chance here. The text are about to go outside. Talk to you in a bit. Uh, Anna stands in the center of the store and taps away to be on the screen. A moment later, she puts her phone down and slowly slaps her tail against the fragile floor void. So, connection speed really isn't the issue here. Is it your favorite brand? Oh, not really. I just heard 404 Live is having dinner with shows, and they have band bag shows at the venue. It's n I've not been to any live show because of staying there. It's too exhausting. I want to try to get this time though. By the way, what's your ID number? Well, I didn't realize that you were close enough to share it. Oh, hey, take it easy. The tickets for calling are density verification. If I manage to get there, I'll go to waste without proper verification. Do you getting a ticket for me? Both of us is close to you. Why not go together? I'll let you know if I manage to get them. Oh, and don't forget to call me if you get them. <gasps> After noting and nabbing the tickets, Ellen strolls lazy to the tuck shop. She crashes on the sofa and falls asleep. It's a well off day for anyway, so let's just get up on sleep. She slept on my couch? Not on my bed? Why not, Ellen? Hey, stop looking! Okay, let's hang out with Colin X. Uh. Okay, um, wishing for a little mate to fall out of the sky. Hmm? I can't make your wish come chill. Hey, excuse me, here's this master post you want. Uh, let's hang out. Okay, I'll go anyway, so what did you decide? Uh, what? The little mate has gone to the house, gone, 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 Oh, my little mate has gone to the house, gone, gone, the small man. I sneak a peek before, the mystery place and special mechan look like pictures. But I didn't prove it because you need to have two people to make team. Sounds really fun. Would you like to go together with me, Master Boxy? That's great. But can I please make an invisible request? Have you won the challenge? Uh, you can keep it. Thank you, Master Boxy. Could you please pick it that time? Uh, that's good for you. Uh, morning. I mean, it's only morning, so let's meet up. You're the haunted house host? That's kind of... Okay. So, it's not going. Do you two want to join the hot house challenge? Hunt the blindfold and come straight into the haunted house. The blindfold? The haunted is the chance of the darkness. Will you and your partner place the unknown location? Every sound and touch offers a brand new experience. So, give me for the coverage of our excitement. How are... Um... And a special medical laboratory. Please give me straight. As you rise in the house, a chill one stunning spot, and you are plugged into darkness. You can't see a thing. This is careful sound all around you. There are faint hisses, sounds of the distance, like that of the wild beast. Did you hear that noise too, Master Fox? Well, what should we do? Should we go around or <laughs> face it down? Face it down? Oh, I right. am speaking with I'm just about to The boy should say more than once. I'm not saying whole thing. On a coerced protective arm of Amos special medicine, the curtain, you can see hear the hissing noises. However, once you lose track of how far the missing noise, it's only a matter of time before you're attacked. Suddenly, you hear a rumbling growl from right beside you. Ah, ah, stay away from me! It's the sound of the chainsaw. Corn has entered combat mode. Quick clack, the sound managed to dodge Corn's first sessions, which can only be described as a miracle. But that's the wild the house are not so lucky, and they'll fall down with a defense crash. Corn, are you near the house? Uh, this is all skills, just as the. Uh, I'm really sorry. I hope you clean any of the guys the bubbles up. I'll uh, back a hell before The two of you slide the tail up together. Once the house is across the original's condition, you're able to, you're able to determine where exactly that noise just does, that then was coming from. Oh, I'm a special little look about Master Boss. Can I really take the prize for myself? Yeah, I've got so much. I'm sure I can have the prize. Really? Wow, I'm a special little look up. Look, Jeff, it's really mine. This is. This is why I want to get with you, Master Proxy. I'm going to put it to good use. Ooh, nice. Now I'll do Nicole. Hey. 
Gonna leave it. I got another business for you. A friend calls. Oh, what is it? I go to your phone first. No, or serious business. Uh, stay out. Where we're we going? Okay, let's just go on Sixth Street. Speaking of Sixth Street, you know what? Very much at Sixth Street. Um, if you give the good kicks and the stuff will come out. It's just everything is just a good people Sixth Street. I think I'm taking it because of you. How about we go there together? Okay. Hi, right. I'll just be interesting. All right, adding and let's go. Hey, you know what? Billy's right here. Let's talk to him. Hey Billy, what brings you video? Ah, oh, sure, you surprised me. It's just that I ate too much and I just had for a stroll. I'm definitely not waiting for Mark a little edition. Poor book. Nope, not me. Uh, I almost bought your story. What? You don't believe it? Can you remind? It's one of your face. Nani? What's this question? Isn't that advanced? How could you have given it away? How does it look at myself if I'm noticing? You're very nasty with Billy. You have actually managed to grab the edition. Congratulations to him. I can't believe it. I finally got it. And even the magician. Thanks, Miss. Thanks, Magician. Have a run, Mr. Good luck. Ooh, actually, you know, let me check the map real quick before I go to. <gasps> Andy's right there. Wait. Oh, yeah, I forgot this is special move with her. Actually, hold on. Let me see who else is out. Oh, the maids. Let's go see them. There's Vox, but where's Ellen? Because Ellen is here too. Let's just talk to him first. It looks like I has some sort of discussion with that guy. The other man quickly took it off the caps. Hello, it's supposed to see you here. I regret that you have to go to the first spot. The what happened? As you saw, the gentleman just now was very lifted. He was losing a floor of wine. After attending tonight's nice dinner, he gave me a ticket to the green salad. The Victor Victoria Housekeeping Co. doesn't prefer the artistic tip. I personally don't like having flashes of treasure with clients beyond the contract. But the client insists on giving it, and even raised the tip on the upper level, I couldn't refuse. But we don't need money, and the funds are the house are significant. What should I do with the money? How about donating? The cheapest is another character. Push me, I just know the right place for a donation. You are not going to confirm the dozen of funds too. Thank you for your help in we out this money. It's my good fortune to have meet you at this time. Well, I should be going now. Hope you have a pleasant day. Yeah, see you, Vox. Now, let's look for Ellen if I can find you. I do see some green text. That's probably her. <gasps> there she is with a school uniform. She was. <laughs> okay, that's weird. She wears maid outfit when I'm around? I mean, when she has with me? Why is that? Were you trying to flush to take me or something, Ellen? No, way, that's because we got next school over. Oh, really? You're just a cool style, you know? Did you make it yourself? No way. You have a friend who really wants this style too. It's too bad she's out with us today. Oh, really? Yeah, otherwise, you two couldn't hear us for sure. Wow. You're a double one. Oh, sorry, that's my friend. Later. After two days, Google, Ellen's finally relaxes quickly. Phew. I didn't think you would be good at chatting with strangers. Huh? What are you talking about? Oh, you mean them? All you need is the basic skill skills. You can get through most closures, which is- Oh, really? No way. And wow. Wow. Did you bite- Uh, I was just doing what you said. Well, chill. I was just kind of for some reason. Wait, does that mean that's how I make other people feel too? Hmm, maybe I do. No, no way. No way, it doesn't matter. Thinking about this gives me the headache. It just keeps doing that I've been doing. Ah, school uniform. Hmm, I want to see underneath, but I can't. It's covered. Well, can I pet you tell? I have no idea where Nicole is. Let's talk to Ambie first. Hey, Ambie. What's up? Oh, it's you. I was just about to go into the video store to see you. Do you want to watch the heartbeat together? Do you want to watch the heartbeat together? Watch it together. If you don't mind, sure. You watch the heartbeat with Ambie. You have to look at... I have nothing to do with the emotional tone from watching the movie still lingers. And it's just you, or did you just hear the fatest of sobs? It's over. The heartbeat was as good as I remember. Especially the ending scene. When the mother finally finds her child in the hollow, and the two of them embrace. No matter how many times I watch it, that scene always moves me. You're sentimental. You're actually quite sentimental, Anby. Really? Nicole said the same thing, but I only seem to get like this when I'm watching a movie. Oh, is it okay if I come by the video store again and get some movie recommendations from you? I'll pay, of course. Of course you can. Of course. Anytime. Hmm. Thanks a lot for today. Yeah, sure, MB. I'm gonna upload you the- <gasps> What? Did she come up with me? Anyways, what's Nicole? Oh, that's a cast as invitation. You serious? Anyway, we got go. I mean, we got Weena to deal with. Jabba stops in front of the seas in the mobile for leaving. 
On the literally morning, I spent some time with Belle in, the, in my room, playing a stage where we have been stuck for a long time. Come on, it's a little more. Hey, there's a trophy up there. Don't worry, I see it. Perfect clear. And we got the trophy. I knew we could do it. The boss is next, so let's take a break first. By the way, I need to go out for a bit after this level. Yo, go. I was destroyed. Right, but we know Shimi said that she might bring a special customer to the store. If I'm not back by then, I'll take care of it. I'm not going anywhere. Thanks, then I'll leave it to you. Just call me if there's an emergency. Shortly, I'll bell leaves the video store so you can play a few more games on the sofa. Then, they will hear the noise coming from the downstairs. It could be you and her special guest. You should go downstairs and take a look. Is it? Um... Good afternoon, dear guy. Oh, no! I suppose I should call you Oh Great Manager here. Yes. Uh, oh, uh, welcome. Oh, uh, welcome to Random Play. It's not here, Rena. I'll go check the shelves back there. Oh, uh, well, all right. Uh, oh, the shelves have hard edges. Be careful not to bump into them and hurt yourself. Who's the old lady? Who's the old lady? Is she looking for something? Oh, my apologies. I forgot to introduce you. That's my client, Granny Laisha. I'm helping her look for a special sort of sweet cake. Sweet cake? Sweet cake? So, some kind of dessert? I don't believe so. It's not just a sweet cake. According to Granny, it's a sweet cake with a silly smile. Rena, the silly sweet cake isn't on the shelves either. I'll check under the counter. I don't think we sell sweets. Okay, Granny, uh, but please don't disturb the other customers. Uh, she can't quite tell me what this silly sweet cake is. But she really wanted to come to 6th Street to search for it, so I thought I'd try my luck at your store. I just can't find it, Rena. I can't find the silly sweet cake anywhere! Oh, please calm down, Granny. I'm here to help. Okay. Do you have any movies about silly, smiling sweet cakes, manager? What? Nah, I don't think so. We've got a lot of silly comedies, but none about sweet cakes. I can't imagine what that looked like. It's a sweet cake that's this big, all round and chubby. And it's so funny when it giggles. Where did it go? We spent the morning looking in the dessert stores, and none of them had a sweet cake that was this big. Mm, silly sweet cake might refer to something round that looks like it's smiling. Well, we're out of dessert stores, so I'll take her to the toy shops this afternoon. Mm, speaking of toys... You just reminded me. Round and with a silly smile. That sounds like Mr. Panda at the coffee shop. Ooh, a glimmer of hope. <sighs> I rarely come to 6th Street, so I'm not very familiar with the area. Thank you for your suggestion, manager. Come on, Granny Laisha. Let's head over. Rena, I can't walk anymore. My legs hurt, and my mouth is dry. We have been walking around for hours. Granny, why don't you rest here a while? Leave Mr. Panda to me. Mr. Panda isn't far away. I'll go take a picture. I'll show it to Granny, and she can decide if it's the sweet cake she's looking for. You guys wait right here. Thanks for your help. I'll stay here and look after Granny while you're gone. Uh, a panda's? Wait, that's it? Not gonna lie, I was expecting to be like a little shorter, but damn, I guess she is older with those pokey tits. Ah, so this panda looking thing. I remember talking to this thing in my first episode? Panda over here, take the picture, and I'll come back. The first Mr. Panda see smile is sticking. I should bring her to Wiener and the old woman. I'm just gonna call her, that sounds kinda rude. Like, you just call her... I forgot what to call her. Hey, Granny Leisha, that's her name. There you go. The bottom layer is vegetable and ham sandwiches. The middle layer is fresh out of the oven butter scones. And the top layer is low sugar fruit cake. Wow. For tea, I have prepared rose tea and red tea. Do you take it with milk and sugar, Granny Laisha? Wow! It did sort of a uh, flatter. I can't believe they set up a three-tier dessert platter. The store has a really posh vibe now. Ah, oh, manager! You're back just in time. Uh, uh, um, please come and enjoy Rena's specialty afternoon tea. Uh, due to the situation at hand, I was unable to make anything myself. So, these were all carefully selected from nearby shops while helping Granny look for the sweet cake. That's a relief. That's a relief. Oh, I, I mean, vegetable and ham sandwiches are balanced and nutritious, so I can have several. Mm. Uh, sweet cakes? Picture? Oh, right, the photo. Oh, right. I took a photo of the silly sweet cake. 
Is this it, Granny? What do you think, Granny Laisha? Does it look familiar? No, this isn't it. I'm looking for the drooling sweet cake. Oh, huh? okay. I thought you were looking for the silly sweet cake. No, it's the drooling one. Oh, no, no, no. I'm, I'm looking for the loud mouth sweet cake. The whole corridor can hear it when it cries. I understand. Well, don't worry. I'll help you find whatever kind of sweet cake you're looking for. Uh, manager, can I have a word? I owe you an explanation. Yeah, you will get to the workshop. First of all, please allow me to express my thanks and apologize for any inconvenience. You see, this lady isn't just any client. She's my evaluator. I participate in the new Eridu Housekeeping Association's assessment each year on behalf of Victoria Housekeeping. This time, my assessment for the best service of the year is to serve Laisha Christie. Yes, Granny Laisha. I had a general idea of what the service would entail, as I've participated in previous years, but this time's a little different. Granny Laisha didn't ask for any housekeeping services. She just keeps asking me to help her find sweet cakes. Uh, this test is trickier than I had expected. She might deliberately be giving me a difficult challenge. Uh, but I'll take care of things myself. I wouldn't want to affect your business. Hmm. It's okay. There's not, there's not much going on with the store. It's okay. There's not much going on with the store. I can keep helping Granny. You can think of me as a free guide to 6th Street. Really? Oh, that'd be great. You're an amazing guide, both in and outside the hollows. Then let's cover all corners of 6th Street and capture photos of any suspicious sweet cakes that fit the criteria. Yeah, we got one so far. Why well, am I looking like now? That's kind of awkward. Are you saying I should take a picture of? Uh... <gasps> oh, we need to get something real quick. Here there is. Selfie. <laughs> hey, wait now. <laughs> it's like your thumbnail. Wait, what's the official thing? Oh, there he is. Do. <laughs> I'm like, hmm, look at that breast size. How big is it? I press this, like, I'm covering them. You can't see it. It's not trying to cover, like, nah, ah, you don't see it. No, no. I press this, like, hmm, wait, nah, you look smashable and beautiful. Do I just talk to these people? I mean, wait, why is it here, though? Okay, anyways, um, we do gotta look around. Why is it saying take photos? How is we one of them? That's kind of awkward. Sweet take photos? Mind thinking is probably this one. You saying this one's one of them? I don't know if that's one of them. That's just a dog. Does that make no sense unless it meets the requirements? Uh, drooling loud mouth? I see, it doesn't meet the requirements of drooling and loud, but it doesn't look a sweet kiss at all. So I couldn't stop this from taking photos. I see, as soon as I pick up the camera, I can't say it started posing. I guess it would be different when the wishes urge to take photos of it. Let's get the photo then. If it's not what Granny Little wants, we can let the puppy actually have to go away this way. Yeah, sure. Actually, let's go back to Rina. She's a sure pose, right? Let's take a picture of her. I just need to get close to her. Wait, what if I did this? Wait, no, no, I gotta do it again. Never mind. What is that to clue me? Is it a clue of me? I was just looking for inspiration. I see, I think I've taken photos of Dozen and Dozen and left with Granny to do a by. Have you decided what they want to do next manager? That's not much you can't betray the time. Um, I want to put your tits. As a joke, but never mind. Why the hell would he be one? He don't look like one. He really doesn't fit the description, if you ask me. I get what you're saying, but don't you think it's a little rude? Imagine the little shark seems quite serious, but I don't really want to get angry if you say he looks like a sweet cake. Hey, what are you saying about sweet cake? I can hear you. We're looking for a lot. We're looking for the drilling sweet cake. I saw someone putting a camera on me. Why? So you will take a photo of me, right? How do you take a photo of me when you're looking for something like that? Don't tell me you think I, you guys really. I'm sorry, we didn't meet you any harm. Please allow to. You can't see the right person. Huh? What do you mean? I know I was going for a new menu. I guess they'll know for a now that I've been busted. That's why right, I'm perfectly waterfall soup for fry soup cake snack. But I can't quite figure out how to make it special enough. Mouth watering soup cake is the great idea as long as with the right feeling. Making mouthful watering soft green soup is the piece of cake, huh? No, 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 nah, not but in the end and at itself. Let's stop the feeling with pop pepper so that it's true and sticky sweet cake. Your tongue gets bambled by the spice, making both the dirt and the mouth watering soup cake drool. I love to keep listening, but it seems like it takes a quite a long time. It's better to leave. Sorry, dude. You take a photo of all the that you can. Double checking that they are doing that little bob. What if it's next to the round shape? Oh, yeah. 
That's one of the missed of my account too, Global now. Oh, Mr. Story. I mean, I guess we're going... Wait. Take a picture of the whole thing? I mean, I guess. We don't come to the scene as you put on the camera. Is there really anything here that fits the criteria of a sweet cake? It's round, and it makes a lot of sound. I... Oh! It's a record! This music store has impeccable taste. The collection is... Ah! This record! Just looking at the cover reminds me of something interesting. Mm. Uh, is it a good song? Are the songs on this album good? Or does hearing it bring back fond memories? Both. There was an incident during the recording of this album. One of the performers quit temporarily. My job was to save the day and perform in her stead. Oh, that was a challenging job. Can you guess which instrument I was in charge of? Why would I say that? Based the way you fight, I guess the piano? Based on the way you fight, I guess the piano. The electric guitar! <laughs> There's no answer to the guitars. Uh, I never have guessed. There's no way I guess that. Right. We've taken pictures of everything we can think of. Let's go back to Granny Laisha. Her sweet cake keeps changing form, but I don't mind it much. The housekeeping association's assessments were always the same in the past. Either a normal service job or going into a hollow to deal with ethereals. Finding something made up is unexpected, but at least it's creative. <laughs> Let's hope these photos contain the sweet cake Granny wants. Yeah, back to the video story. Hey, Gunny. Is this what you want? Oh, you're back! Rena and... Uh, Rena's little sidekick. What a same hike. Like, please call me Wise. I'm not a sidekick, Granny Laisha. I'm the manager here. Just call me Wise. Sorry, Manager Wise. Please allow me to apologize on her behalf. Okay, Granny. We have the pictures. Are any of these the loud sweet cake? Hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, no. None of these are the sweet cake. The one I'm looking for. Oh, I remember now. Waves. The sweet cake was floating on white waves up and down. Yes, that's it. It was a white wave sweet cake. Just like the one always floating around you, Rena. I I'm glad to hear you like my bang boo. But they're not sweet cakes. They're my trusted companions with their own names. For example, this little blonde bang boo with bangs is called Drusilla. Oh, if I hadn't turned on silent mode earlier, it would certainly be making a fuss about how the sweet cake has changed yet again by now. Hmm. Uh, what could the wave sweet cakes be? Yeah, why has it changed again? A white wave sweet cake that looks like Drusilla. Master, if I could interrupt by combining the keywords Laisha Christie and waves, I have found a news article about an incident involving a Miss Metropolitan beauty pageant dropout. That voice just now. Uh, it was a smart voice on my phone. It's the smart voice assistant on my phone. Uh, don't worry about it. Oh, <laughs> well, that's a very thoughtful AI assistant. Of course, I understand it's your little secret. Further inquiry would go against Victoria Housekeeping's rules of etiquette. In any case, it's a timely tip. Let me check the news. I should be able to find it on my phone. Miss Metropolitan Dropout. Ah, here we go. And it's actually a news article from 41 years ago. On the night of the highly anticipated finals, top contender Laisha Christie, favored to win, suddenly drops out, conceding her crest of waves. I see. So, the Crest of Waves is a round crystal trophy awarded to the winner. There's also a photo of the dropout attached. If I compare it, it's true. I never would have expected the housekeeping evaluator would be the star of such a contest. Huh, what a mysterious lady. The sweet cake floating up and then down. Oh, it must refer to Granny losing the trophy. If that's the case, it's easy. We simply need to bring her the Crest of Waves trophy. Easy? I think you're redefining the term easy there, Rina. Where are we gonna get a 41-year-old trophy? The competition is held every year, even now. I just happened to have participated last year. 
Wait, you participated? Wait, Rina, you participated in Miss Metropolitan? Yes. The competition was divided into many sections, such as singing, acting, painting, cooking. Can you guess which I took part in? Hmm. Uh, something unlike you, the cooking? Based on my last guess with the instruments, I'd have to assume something unlike you. Could it be cooking? Why is cooking unlike me? Hmm, I'm a little curious, but never mind. I'll tell you, the answer is... All of them! <laughs> Actually, that year's competition was in urgent need of a makeup artist, so I stepped in to help. It was quite busy, but still an enjoyable experience. Um, uh, what? Who could have guessed that? Who could have guessed that? I feel like I've been tricked. <laughs> oh, I was just teasing you. Please, don't mind me. But because of that, I know the competition organizers. So asking them for a commemorative trophy shouldn't be a problem. Rina, can you find my wave sweet cake? Don't worry, Granny. I'll find it for you. Whatever kind of sweet cake it is, it's getting late. I'll take her home first. You should get some rest too. Thank you again for your help. Yeah, sure, Rina. Now, do we go to Bell next to speak with her? Yes, we do. Hey, man. A lot of things happen. Is that really just her that's so granny that we don't mention? Yep. She's a live vile granny, that's for sure. Judging by your reaction, you must have tired of tiring day then. No wonder we said it was a special guest. Um, she falls on the street, is tiring. What a pity I wasn't able to help out. Have, have a good first prize. If you want, uh, the next time when granny comes by, you tag out and let me entertain her for a while. Yeah, 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 I think I'm done. Just when I'm going back in the last I bump to Rina. Good morning, Master. I will see you in the morning. Are you here for the better belief? No, I'm just going to be present by two, so I feel I'll be sitting back for everyone. Oh, uh, about Granny. Direction for the Quest of Way trophy has been submitted. So, this is the legendary Victorian speed I heard about. I just made the vision. If it suddenly goes smoothly, I should be with you in a couple of days. Then we just need to pick up a good time to give to Granny. Let me, let me know when you're planning to give the trophies out. That would be great. Should we do it if we can go through similarly? It's a deal then. Anyways, I need to get back to Victoria and ask you Have a nice day. Yes, you. What does game, uh, Victor Housekeeping place in this um game soon? After saying goodbye to me, you turn to the video story. Okay, go inside. It's not behind the shelves. Granny Lasha? Granny Lasha? What are you doing here? I'm looking for the sweet cakes. The silly sweet cake isn't behind the shelf. Ah, oh, I remember you. You can help me find the sweet cakes, right, Drusilla? My name is Wise. I'm not Drusilla. My name is Wise. Say it with me, Granny. Wise. Uh, never mind. I'll call Rena. <laughs> yeah. And by the way, we'll at the beauty store. Are you looking for the silly sweet cake again, Granny? Is this still part of the assessment? Oh, but it's okay. I still have the pictures from yesterday. Here, Granny. Are any of these photos the sweet cakes you're looking for? Uh, Granny? Granny, are you listening? Granny Laisha? <sighs> She's completely focused on the TV. Uh, manager, what's that on the TV in the corner? Is that an ad for a movie? No, she's looking at point. It's Invasion Next Gen. Yeah, it's Invasion Next Gen. <gasps> what? <gasps> it's about the hollow appearing in the city. It's about a hollow appearing in the city and the ethereals inside. <gasps> it's a hollow. There's a hollow. The sweet cakes are in danger. Uh, what's wrong, Granny? That's just a movie. It's not real. Oh, oh, my Drusilla! Granny blush your grass as it rushes out the story. If this is still part of the assessment, it seems a little bit excessive. Or perhaps Granny really was affected by the ad. We should go to By medication, guys? Drusilla has a GPS chip, so don't worry. We won't lose her. She's like, I'm being harassed by Granny, help! Granny! Oh, he's not, she's not that far away. She's still advising, what the hell is the old girl going with that, with that... Drazilla thing. You okay? Hey, what should I want? <laughs> Why can't I be safe? Please don't worry, Granny Jilla. We're here to help. Help me, yes, quick. Come help me, Win, and your little sidekick. 
I was. There might be other secret traps. I can't see them by myself. Please, can you ever find them? Don't run away. We're going to help you, but you have to tell us where those secrets are. Let me take the kids back to safe spot. You wait for me. I'll be back soon to help you search. Before we can apply, the great bounce off toys that one on one could story clutching onto the bamboo. Where are the other she's trying to go? The only way is to find out if she's to follow her. Yeah, something's going on with her. It's like, is she on, an, um, is she on medication where she's going crazy for analysis? She's back to normal. Like later on? Is she good or? Pink any. Ooh, the hole hasn't come up yet. Ah, keep going, try harder. Okay, you can easily get up like that. If you want to go slow, you can walk slow and have a nice try along the way. We can't walk. We have to run right now. Let's quick. Otherwise, I'll get us. Ugh. Ah, never mind. Before we can finish, the gray spins out towards the metro station. In fact, the eye initially went into the metro station. Is she actually going to catch the metro? It doesn't matter, just catch up and try to least before the same train as her. Otherwise, you'll lose her. Like, what the fuck is happening? That's kind of weird for her. Granny! Oh, wait. Pick destination. Uh, turn on navigation? Okay, where is she? Oh, she says right there. Grand Legion is busy quite on the way, and David doesn't see cars any workers before getting off of the Moscow station. I see her. She's just over there. Yep, it's over there. Granny! Oh my god, with Rina floating around, it goes like, ooh. Like, hey, Leisha, do you mind? Oh, should be. Fly away from the hollows now. No, 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 those things are. I'll fly more further than up going else. They can't handle this. Better go for out just a little. Are you all. All of you get the running because the hollow's calling. Granny seems to do the tile, yet never balance her plans to escape. Clutching into the bamboo, she wants her toys to wave aside tail. Why do I get the feeling that she's seeking me for a bad guy here? No more Amy's running around like this. Next time I'll catch her. You have to get to the bottom of this. Yeah, like, what's going on with her? She got easily influenced by that BS and then it's like, ah, hollows. They're not see unless they are. Okay, so do this. Hold down or something? Hey, are you okay, Gadisha? She really does look tired at this time. And she passed out. Well, is this thing up in my Granny Legion let me as the search shifts on and smiths off again. Why was she trying to go? The only way she found is to follow her. Again? I thought she passed out, but I guess she's just winding around, going crazy, with people going like, what the hell is that old girl? Is she on drugs? And she's up in a parking spot. Oh, lovely no one's here. Why are we here? Like, what's going on with this? I can't run anymore. My legs hurt, and my mouth is dry. Have you calmed down now, Granny Leisha? Uh, you guys! What's with the surprise? No need to act so surprised. We've been right behind you since 6th Street and all through Lumina Square. You! Uh, who are you? Amnesia? I don't have any money or anything of value. Why are you chasing me? I don't know you. Huh? Granny Leisha, are you being serious? I'm Rena, and this is the video store manager, Wise. Uh, um, no. No idea who you are. Then, do you still remember the sweet cakes you're looking for? The silly sweet cake, loud sweet cake, and wave sweet cake? Sweet cakes? Oh, yes. I remember. I'm looking for my sweet cakes, but I've lost them all. I arranged to look for sweet cakes for someone yesterday. Hmm. Who, who, who was it again? What's going on? What's going on? Is the Housekeeping Association's assessment process really this complicated? With her reaction to that ad, I'm afraid this is more than just the housekeeping assessment. Have you heard the medical term, cognitive corruption syndrome? Anyone who stays too long in a hollow may develop the disease in their later years, regardless of their ether aptitude. Symptoms include rapid memory decline, cognitive disorder, and repetitive speech. In severe cases, one's memory can regress to that of decades ago, forgetting everything that occurred afterward. Did she really forget us? You mean she really forgot us? I'm mm -hmm. just speculating. But having provided care for elderly individuals with this condition in the past, it's all far too familiar. The constantly changing sweet cakes, not recognizing us. If it's not an intentional act, then it seems like the most likely possibility. Either way, I'll take Granny home first. There are plenty of ways I can confirm my hypothesis. 
Thank you, manager. You must be tired too. You should go back and rest. Okay. Uh, let me know what happened, Rina. Okay. Let me know what happens, Rina. Goodbye, Granny Laisha. Mm -mm. <sighs> Goodbye. I'm sorry for the inconvenience caused to your store these past few days. Please pass on my apologies to Belle too. Yeah, let's give a hug and say goodbye. After all, buddy, you'll surely got your day step for the day. Go back to business and get some rest. Like, oh uh, my leg. Uh, like, ouch. Hey, Bill. Are you watching? I was gone. Like, ow, my leg. Huh? Rena apologized to me? <laughs> Well, you're always the one taking care of things whenever she visits. I haven't even met Granny yet. Ah, oh, you're both here. Oh, oh, did you just teleport it? Real quick. That was fast. Is Granny's house close to here? She lives near Lumina Square, so it didn't take long. But I'm a little worried about her. I checked with the neighbors. She's lived alone for a long time. And she does suffer from cognitive corruption syndrome. If that's the case... Granny isn't intentionally causing trouble. It's because of her illness. Yeah, that's why I I'm thought. I'm surprised the housekeeping association chose her for the assessment. By the way, why didn't Drusilla resist when it got taken by Granny? It's a combat bang boo. It could have easily gotten away from her. Hmm, but it was on silent mode? Is it because it had been switched to silent mode? Even in silent mode, Drusilla can move on its own. I asked the same thing on the way here, and it gave me an unexpected answer. When Granny carried it away, she kept saying, I can do it. I can protect you. That made it mistake Granny for me. Is this some kind of passcode? Huh? Is that possible? There's a pretty big difference. Could that phrase be some kind of passcode? The Drusilla in front of you is actually designed based on a doll I picked up when I was little. I didn't have many friends at the manor back then. All I had to talk to was the doll I named Drusilla. Father didn't like the doll. He said it was something the servants had used, and told me to throw it away. But... how could I throw away my only friend? So, I hid it in various places, trying hard to prevent my father from finding it. Under the bed, in the wardrobe, under the covers, constantly telling it, I can do it. I can protect you. When I became an agent, and decided to use Bang Boo in combat, I handed this doll over to the manufacturer. Surprisingly, during their inspection, they found a tiny recording device inside the doll, <laughs> as expected. It was already filled with the phrase, I can protect you. So, impulsively, I transferred the recording data, along with the name Drusilla, to the Bang Boo. A manor? Servants? So you were actually a wealthy heiress living in a mansion when you were younger, Rina? Oh, now's not the time for gossip, though. Let's get back to Drusilla. Granny was muttering the same thing when she rushed out of the video store with Drusilla. To call it a passcode is actually fitting. You're saying she mistook Drusilla for one of the sweet cakes and took it out of the store to avoid some kind of danger? Judging from that ad. Judging from the ad that affected Granny, her sweet cakes were once, or are now, in danger because of a hollow. But just what are these sweet cakes? We'll struggle to get to the bottom of things if we're unable to figure that out. However, the competition dropout and Crest of Waves trophy were both real at least. And the wave sweet cake is still an important clue. I'll bring it back with me and talk to Granny. Oh, I didn't realize how late it was. Sorry to keep the two of you. It's fine, really. It's not that late. Thank you. How about I bring some special tea treats I made myself as a token of my appreciation? That's really no need. There's really no need. Then I best be off. Please do let me know if Granny turns up at the store again. Yeah, sure. Kind of a certain. That does explain quite a few things, but also most even more mysteries. What exactly are these sweet cakes? Leave it all to Vina. Doesn't she say she was taking the Queen's Away trophy over ex Granny to the Shah? I was you when you said before, wise, that I entertain Granny's next time she come. Yet here you are well, well, all day once again. You went away around the around square, Lamar Square. I must be destined to cross path with path with Vina. Anyway, get some rest. I feel like you put a little week to worth of workout in one day. Your legs are going to get sore tomorrow. Yeah, you think legs are hot and pain? There's a big sale of the long guard today, and Belle always to get up early to line with together with you and do some shopping deals. However, it seems that you haven't gone up early enough. I shall come early. I can't be so while still in line. Get out the train another mile. 
uh, mail. Oh, mall. Okay. I didn't expect the line to be this long. By the way, did you see going lush today? No, I haven't. Why are you asking me that all of a sudden? Really is hexing. Doesn't have to granny. I'm always in a fuel store. I'll tell you more when I get there. If you can get there before I do, please keep it down to work. Thanks. That was her message. Let's go night away for her. Sure, let's go and come up with her, her to the next time. And so we watch back to the view story. In a car. Like, ah! How are you, manager? Has Granny been to your store lately? No, has something happened? No, has something happened? I obtained the Crest of Waves replica trophy this morning and went to take it over to her. But the place was empty. And her door was ajar. The neighbors say she caused a commotion late last night. Banging on doors, claiming a hollow was coming. And she was going to White Wave Hospital to save the sweet cakes. <sighs> She's been searching for sweet cakes everywhere for weeks now. So nobody took it seriously. And they convinced her to go back to her room and go to sleep. But by morning, she disappeared. She often goes out early to look for the sweet cakes. But this is the first time she hasn't locked her door. And the first time she's mentioned White Wave's hospital. Oh, it just seems odd. I filed a missing person report to public security. So I'm just waiting to hear from them now. The White Wave Hall Hospital saved the, to save the sweet cake. Gone to White Wave's hospital to save the sweet cakes. That's a new term. Searching for information on White Waves Hospital. White Waves Hospital is a renowned, large-scale, comprehensive medical facility in New Eridu. Earlier records go back 41 years to when it was forced to relocate due to a hollow disaster. Wait, 41 years ago? Wait, 41 years ago? That's the same year as that competition. With funding from both the government and the public, White Wave Hospital, which has been relocated several times, retained most of its medical resources. Its symbol is a white wave. A white wave? Is it a coincidence? Or have we been wrong from the start? The beauty pageant, the hospital, the wave? There must be a connection between the three. Most likely. If you'll excuse me, manager, I'm going to contact a friend who works in medicine to investigate. Let me know if you hear anything about Granny. Let me know if you hear anything about Granny, even if she doesn't remember my name. Uh, well, as my current client, I must ask you to forgive her rudeness. I'm her maid, so please allow me to remember your name in her stead. Well then, I'll be going. Please don't let my affairs affect you. You have your own business to run, after all. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's my way. We know. We know said she didn't want us to go out for a way for her. But I'm still kind of... I'm still concerned. Yeah, you think so too, right? It would be great if we could do something more to help her. Master, considering the current scenario, I suggest elaborating full necro deal collection function. While carrying up and complete the target course per action over the past 24 hours, I can quickly analyze the most like activated location. We can do that? Why didn't you say so earlier? Disclaimer, the Kajin was connected to a large number of necro interfaces and features and multiply set of particular computing unit power consumption cannot be kept within the daily face way in other words it's very extremely associated I estimate a 55% increase of the month's power bill um I knew it just 55 understood pushing the granny by massive to wave L library I have started calling granny's leisure course of action calculation complete huh that's it isn't this meant to be some sense of progress like an others or a hat the extra percent just spent on the custody. Result, the percent of green legend has entered the hollow is 97.1%. What? It lacks a parcel. I shouldn't be so for the unfairness. A hollow wipe. We didn't fall in quickly. Yeah. Wait up! Wait up. Uh, green might have gone to the hollow. I never considered the person before. Green has always afforded the hollow. Why don't we go to the and by ourselves? But I believe you. I don't know. No one knows more about hollows than you do. We use three parts of the legislative bill to figure it out with a library of 97%. Got it, it's also done by Mrs. Mazzio. Although I could report to Post Security and wait for them to finish the search, I would have to go find one myself and bring her out. After all, I still have some sweet cakes to find as promised, so I could actually a company for me a trip to Hollow. Deal guide? I got you. Thanks for your much. See you in a bit. Lock a grand legacy and let's go out of the Hollow. I was expecting the story to be like no fighting. I didn't expect it to be towards the end, honestly. Like a chill day? Well, well. Preparations complete. I'm ready to begin, dear guide. 
Dear guide, I like the sound of that. Dear guide, I like the sound of that. <laughs> Unfortunately, I cannot base my terms of address on personal preference. Using the correct titles in the right situations is important etiquette at Victoria Housekeeping. Now, let's get back to Granny. Based on our current intel, I'm certain her cognitive corruption syndrome is getting worse. Uh, her memory has already regressed to that day 41 years ago. That day? That day 41 years ago? Yes. The Miss Metropolitan dropout incident and the White Waves Hospital Hollow disaster both happened on the same day. And Granny Laisha was involved in both. Well, what does this got to do with sweet cakes? But what does this have to do with Granny's search for sweet cakes? There is a connection. A big one. The sweet cakes are the link between these two events, and have been the source of strife in Granny's heart for 41 years. Uh, it's a long story. I had to contact a lot of people and piece it all together. But we don't have much time, so let's talk on the way. Yeah, sure, go on. Granny Leisha from 41 years ago. She'd have been around my age now. Mm. Wait. So you're actually in your 40s, not 30s? Oh, wait, probably in her 20s, but a little older. A little older. She's actually in her 40s. She worked as a nurse at the White Waves Hospital back then. Uh -huh. She was in charge of taking care of the newborns. I always thought she'd be in her 20s or 30s. Don't just smile at me. Go to sleep already. The more sleep you get, the quicker you'll grow. Is that her? <laughs> You're drooling. Let me wipe it off. She was talking about our foy. Hey, that's quite the set of pipes you've got. Can you keep it down? <laughs> You're going to frighten the other babies. The hospital was short handed. So Granny Laisha was always busy. Still, she loved her work. Of course, aside from her work, she had other things she wanted to accomplish. Oh dear, looks like we've got a bit of a situation. Let's tackle the issue at hand first. Open. Huh. Looks like we need two people to open this door. Wina. Look, there's another button to control the door over there. Wina. They can handle pressing the buttons. Boy. Leave it to me! Not you! Both of us! I'll leave these two children with you, Proxy. Yeah. Please okay. bring them with you as you search for a way forward. Temporary access permissions for Drusilla and Anastella received. Action request approved. Initiating override. That's one. Me, me, pick me! The operational interface has been switched to Anastella. Lead Anastella to push the button ahead. Great! Now Drusella can get through. I've stepped on the button! Okay. You can use the permissions I've granted you to switch between them. Yeah, thanks for that. Um... Aren't you... Down there? Is that good? Wait, are we good? We're here! Oh. Both of us! Oh, go do that. I'm here! Drusilla too! There's another up ahead. There's a huge switch up ahead! Seems like we need two Bangboo to step on it. Leave it to Anastella and me! Go, go, go! Drusilla! Gear coins! I found them! I'm standing on it! It's your turn, Anastella! They sound cute. Oh my god, like children which I have. Okay. Lots of treasure! Oh yes you did. Uh hold on, what is this doing here? Let me... Come on, step down hard on that switch. Once they both get through, they'll be able to step on the main switch. Uh so I'll just switch it right here. Main switch? Drusilla! I'm coming! We're here! <laughs> Gonna step on the main switch! Yeah! 
Aren't my little Bang Boo amazing? Oh, Their guide no. is pretty amazing too, of course. Now then, let's proceed. Let me continue with Granny's story. When she was young, Granny dreamed of becoming an actress. Uh huh. The actress toy? So she signed up for a beauty contest in her free time. That's right. It was the Miss Metropolitan pageant. Okay. Not just her colleagues. But she, too, was surprised at how far she got. Let's walk and talk. Okay. Granny emerged as the dark horse that year. To everyone's surprise, the judges gave her high scores. And just like that, Laisha Christie made it into the finals. Yet, on the day of the finals... Is she coming? I remember in the news. In a corner of the broadcasting room, numerous screens were showing the broadcast of the glamorous stage. But among them, an old TV was airing a piece of breaking news. It was a hollow alert for areas including the White Waves Hospital. And so, on the screens showing that magnificent stage, the rising star who was about to be crowned Beauty Queen ran down the red carpet steps without turning back and headed to the place on that old TV screen. Seems we have some uninvited listeners up ahead. Oh, yeah, you know well. Let's pause the story there for now. Yeah, let me just grab some of this stuff. And beat this guy's ass! Okay, we know. Oh, this is a background music? For battle? Okay! That's like a power to come back. Off you go! Maybe this is how to have a way to go. Oh, huh? You got it too. Never mind. There you go. Barrel down! Damn, okay, let's go. Sick! Just listen to watch the Aska? Oh, yeah. So many openings. Off you go. Hit this one, Nina. Get this. Got that one. Attack. Then the call to the flip on the whales. Does touch your head? Probably not. No, I'm okay. You know it hurts. I'll be good. Okay. Now we're going. We can reach depths of the hollow if we keep going this way. Once you enter, you won't be able to return. Make sure you've done everything you need to do before moving forward. Yeah, we'll be fine. Okay. Well done, though. This went up. Ah, it's yet another strange door. Yeah, and more different mechanisms. That should be where the main switch is. Okay, bamboos. Time to step on the button again? Yes. Step on the button, step on the button! Temporary access permissions for Drusilla and action request There's approved. There's still a button left Initiating to override. Let's go. I'm standing on it! Okay. Keep us here. Stepped on it! One more ahead! Okay, um, do I go? Oh, yeah, I've done this. Okay, I'm gonna press I. Hold I. Grab the coin, go ahead. Uh. Okay. Press this. And you do this. The main switch! It's done! Good job, We're too. very close to our destination now, Rena. 
Yes. And Granny's story is coming to an end. Okay, it comes to the end? Yeah, yeah, good. Sufficient gear coins paid. Authentication successful. Opening valve. Okay. This, we can hold on because HP is fine. Okay. So we touch this just in case. And then here we go. Ada will fully heal, that's completely okay. Is that Granny? Are the kids all right? Oh no. Oh no! The main door is blocked. I remember the emergency exit should be. Ah! I found it! What? Don't be scared. I'm coming! I'll protect you all! The hospital had already been enveloped by the hollow. It was pitch black everywhere, and things were in chaos. Glacia didn't have time to worry about her tattered pageant gown. She took off her high heels to run and climb barefoot. She kicked away the obstacle that blocked the main door. In a panic, she couldn't remember the names of all the children, relying on her memory. She searched for one swaddled baby after another. Those clothes were all imprinted with the hospital's wave pattern. One baby giggling happily in the hollow. One baby that was drooling. And another that cried at the top of their lungs. They were the wave sweet cakes Granny was searching for. That must have been when she contracted cognitive corruption syndrome. Most likely. This is the last obstacle. Let's get rid of it in one fell swoop and find Granny. Last clue to get through. Okay. As usual, I'll leave you to take the little ones. Yeah. Let's push this. Oh, great. Look where it is. That's trapped. We need to find a way to bring it with us. I mean that. Can you? Oh, it's already turned. Wait, what? Um. Oh, it's just right there. Okay, never mind. There we go. Never mind. Hold on, hold up. There you go. So this has to come with us either way. Um we'll be fine. Button Oh wait. Yeah, stay right there. Well no, that's still not Okay, the push is out of the way. Okay. Push me to push us through. Box can press button too! Oh yes! Okay, that's one. I'm out! Let's do it together! Three, two, one! Two, one! Let's three, two, one. You can say three. Oh well. Biosignatures detected up ahead. Granny Laisha should be there. Ooh. Yes, we should hurry up. Huh. These two Bang Boo suddenly seem pretty useful. Thank you for the compliment. We might have to battle Ethereals later, so I'm going to withdraw your access for now. Here we fight. So let's fight them off. Not here. Here. Oh, good. We found her, and she doesn't look hurt. Just not in a stable emotional state. I lost all the sweet cakes. The sweet cake with a silly smile. The sweet cake with a loud voice. And the drooling sweet cake. I couldn't protect any of them. Did you say the secrets were all saved? Huh? Arena. Didn't you say all the sweet cakes had been saved back then? Yes, I'm quite certain they were all saved. There's only one explanation. She doesn't even remember them being saved. Her memory has regressed to the night she was at the hospital. So she can only search for her missing sweet cakes. For her, 
The conclusion no longer exists. Uh, Granny Laisha? Do you remember me? I'm Rina, and the new Eridu Housekeeping Association appointed me to help you. Oh, sweet cake! <laughs> it's a sweet cake! She grabbed all of Judah like she did in the store and hold it tight. Don't be scared. Even if you're all that's left, I'll protect you. Multiple ethereals detected. Rapidly approaching this area. We need to leave. Brina, Granny Laisha. We need to get out of here. Things will get dangerous if we don't hurry. There's always happening. Ethereals are coming, Granny. Come on, we have to go. Don't be scared. I'll protect you. I will. You have to let go, Granny. That isn't your sweet cake. It's a sweet cake. I won't lose another sweet cake. She won't listen. What do we do, Rena? Rena! Name, Laisha Christie. Nurse ID, 2107. Your sweet cakes aren't lost. The silly, smiling sweet cake still loves to smile. She became a maternity nurse, just like you. The loud sweet cake doesn't talk much over the phone. But he said he'll come see you right after his concert finishes. <sighs> the drooling sweet cake has already become a senior investigator. Listen he to me. He might be off fighting ethereals as we speak. You didn't lose them, Granny. They just grew up. Now, it's finally their turn to protect you. Yeah, like shocked it very hard. Yep, it's so. open. Five waves! Oh, come on, seriously? Oh, it's not alone. We got Rina and Nicole here. Here's the support. Ready and waiting. This won't hurt. Can I do that? Can I do that? Okay. Clear out. The yeah, arena. Don't be scared. But I need. Big one. Ready and waiting. Oh, you're not done. Just blow it around. Whee! Oh, careful. Avoid it. Oh, yay. Sick. Okay. This is the fourth wave. With the big ones. Six. What's that? Can I have to be big? So many things. Most likely to be a big one. Never mind. Hey, come here. Damn, stand! Let's not disappoint our customers! Get in. Down! Oh, instantly! Damn! That's it. We're out of danger, and Granny Laisha has calmed down. How are you feeling? Do you recognize me now? You look familiar. I, I think I've seen you before. On TV? It's okay if you don't remember me. But do you still remember looking for the sweet cakes? Sweet cakes? Not a fan of cakes. They're sticky and dry out your mouth. Uh, shouldn't we remember the sweet cakes? No. She forgot the sweet cakes too? Do you remember anything that happened the last few days? What you had for breakfast, where you were, and who you spoke to yesterday? Hmm. No, I don't remember. Ah. Oh, I remember now. I'd lost something for a long time, and a kind soul helped me find it. Oh, what was it I lost? I can't recall. Um, and who was it that helped me? That's okay. As long as you found it, the who isn't important. I'll remember all the unimportant details for you. Well now, I'd already contacted all the sweet cakes before we went into the hollow. They're on their way to Granny's place, so we'd best be getting back. Oh yeah. Ah, 
There you are, Miss Rina. I'm your contact from the new Eridu Housekeeping Association. Regarding your call, did you have an update for us? Yes, I've completed the assessment. Shall we discuss the specifics at Granny's house? Ah, uh, about that, Miss Rina. I have to apologize. After double-checking, we realized she wasn't the client for your assessment. Mm -hmm. What do you mean? We got her mixed up with a lady of the same name. Lacia Christie. Actually, this elderly lady came to the association a few times, saying she's looking for her sweet cakes. But staff always got rid of her. But someone got careless that day. They let her in the assessment reception room and then... Well, the rest was a coincidence. If it weren't for carelessness and coincidence, she'd still be out there searching. So things turned out okay. As for the official assessment, could I ask you to file with the association as soon as possible? Later, perhaps. I need to get her home first. There are several people waiting for her. Uh, I'll go with you. Perhaps there is some kind of compensation the housekeeping association can offer. Well then, I'll come see you at the store as soon as I'm finished. Serena sends a wing to this way and with a gentle bow, she leaves with Granny Alicia and a staff member. Belle then head back to the store and wait for her from her. Hear from her. Sometimes later, Wiener comes through the view story door like a ghost. Hello, manager. I appreciate your help these last few days. How is Granny? How is Granny? The bad news is her memory is in severe decline. She doesn't recognize anyone anymore, let alone her sweet cake. But the rest is good news. The Housekeeping Association contacted a suitable nursing home for her, and the Sweet Cakes all agreed to visit her on different days. She may not remember them, but everyone is looking forward to spending time with her. Perhaps one day she'll remember something. Perhaps one day she, there'll be a cure. Perhaps one day people will find a cure for Cognitive Corruption Syndrome. That would be nice. Cognitive Corruption Syndrome. Who knows? I've been in the Hollows for so long, Perhaps I have it without even realizing. When I'm old, I might be looking for sweet cakes just like Granny Laisha. <laughs> no. I'll probably be far more stubborn, rebellious, and unwilling to listen than her. Well, don't forget to bring me along. Looking for sweet cakes. Sounds like fun. Don't forget to bring me along. It's a promise then. When that day comes, don't be put off when I turn into Granny Rena. And stick with me until I find my sweet cakes. Okay. Now we talk to Belle and the story is over. Here's the thing, Galicia has completely forgotten about us and even though everything is so out now, I still feel as those things missing something important. Right up until the very end, Granny could never even get my name right. Why? And not just here, she didn't even remember Mina's name. Maybe she'll still remember one day. Maybe I'll check out some news on the couple of couple system and there are some promising case out there. It's not a complete recovery, but there's a still still a chance they slowly were getting some primitive memories. Then I hope she'll at least be able to remember Wina. Well, let's we'll think too much about it for now. I've been running around like the headless chicken and falling behind up the commission. I'm going to focus energy back on our property work. Yes, yeah, sis. Alright, I'm gonna go there. Like subscribe, I'll see you later. Sayonara.